Aarti first noticed a problem in her sight vision around 3 weeks ago. She has stopped driving since then because she found it difficult to keep a watch of the vehicles on the road. Her brother Arun convinced her to see an ophthalmologist instead of giving up. Hello Aarti, how can I help you? Hello doctor, I'm having difficulty seeing objects on both sides. This is causing a problem while driving. Don't worry Aarti, we'll conduct a few tests. The tests suggest that you have glaucoma. What is glaucoma, doctor? Is it something that I should be worried about? Glaucoma is a disease that damages the nerve of the eye, also known as optic nerve, which relays information to the brain. Glaucoma is the most common cause of permanent blindness and affects about 1.2 crore people in India. 90% of glaucoma cases remain undetected and 40% of vision can be lost before one becomes aware of it. Once vision is lost, it cannot be restored. But with early detection and proper treatment, we can help to preserve vision. You are lucky, Arti. Your glaucoma has been diagnosed early. How does glaucoma affect my eye? Let me explain it to you through this video. Our eyes contain a fluid called aqueous humor, which provides nourishment to the eye tissues. In glaucoma, this fluid drains inefficiently or the passage through which it drains becomes blocked, causing eye pressure to build up. This causes damage to the blood vessels and the optic nerve, resulting in permanent vision loss if left untreated. Doctor, you said something about eye pressure. So, how does increased eye pressure affect glaucoma? Elevated eye pressure increases the risk of having glaucoma. However, it is possible for people to have glaucoma with below average eye pressure. Also, not everyone with high pressure will develop glaucoma. The ideal or normal eye pressure for different individuals varies. There are two types of glaucoma. Primary glaucoma, which has no identifiable cause and occurs in predisposed individuals. Open angle glaucoma and angle closure or narrow angle glaucoma are the subtypes of primary glaucoma. And the other type is secondary glaucoma that occurs secondary to other causes such as eye injury, eye surgery, certain eye diseases, certain systemic diseases or steroid use. Do all patients with glaucoma have issues with their vision? No, some patients may not have any symptoms. So, I would recommend even Arun to get checked since glaucoma often runs in the family. I am fine, doctor. It is only Aarti who has blurred vision. Oh, come on, Arun. It is always good to follow doctor's advice. Okay, fine. Let's run a few tests, Sarun. Arun, you also seem to have early stages of glaucoma. Glaucoma is often referred to as the silent thief of sight. Most people are unaware that they have a problem as there are no symptoms in the beginning. In the early stages, side vision is affected and at the end stage, central vision is also affected leading to blindness. But the good news is that People with glaucoma can have a good quality of life without fear of going blind if their glaucoma is detected early and treated properly. So early diagnosis and treatment is the key. How is glaucoma diagnosed, doctor? Glaucoma can be diagnosed only by a thorough eye exam. It involves eye pressure evaluation, that is tonometry, drainage angle evaluation, that is gonioscopy, clinical evaluation of the optic nerve, side vision testing or perimetry. Can our glaucoma be cured? Glaucoma can be only treated, not cured. There are many treatment options for glaucoma. Aim of glaucoma treatment is to reduce eye pressure and prevent further vision loss. Treatment options for glaucoma include eye drops, laser, glaucoma filtering surgery, tube implants and minimally invasive glaucoma surgery. Oh, will we have to undergo surgery immediately? We may begin treatment with eye drops. 
If high pressure is not controlled by drops, laser or if nerve damage is worsening, then we may decide if we need to perform surgery. In some patients, more than one surgery is needed in their lifetime. Thank you, doctor. If we had not visited you for my blurred vision, even Arun wouldn't have come for a checkup today. That's true, doctor. So when should one decide to see a doctor? People who use steroids are above 40 years of age, have an eye injury, have high refractive error that is near sight or far sight, have undergone eye surgery, and who have parents or siblings with glaucoma are at an increased risk of glaucoma. If you are above 40 years or at increased risk of glaucoma, then you should get a baseline screening. Once diagnosed, periodic follow-up throughout lifetime is necessary.